So, a bunch of you guys wrote suggestions down on paper before you actually sat down in your seats. And our comedians are going to decide whether they want to create a set at random based off of those suggestions and pick three and improvise a joke for you. Or, if they want to answer a question from the book of questions, uh, which they will have to justify. And they have never seen the book or any of the suggestions before. And who wants to go first? I grew up overweight, everyone's like, when did you first realize you were overweight? The answer is simple, it's my first boys and girls swim party. All the boys are like, mommy, mommy, why do the girls have something up here? And all the girls are like, mommy, mommy, why does Dan have bigger tits than us? <laughs> 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 Pornography. Pornography. I, uh, I don't know. I don't watch pornography. Um, I live it. Um, <laughs> going in for the handshake, but the other person is going in for the fist bump, then you realize you're in front of a mirror and you don't know who you are. <laughs> if you see a white guy living in, 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 a, in the hood, and I don't mean like born and raised in the hood, I mean like it's out of nowhere, 23, he just showed up, don't fuck with him. If he did something to screw up living with the other white people, he lost that privilege. <laughs> You don't talk about that. Right. Fair enough. I called my mom the other day to tell her I had a job interview, which I finally did. It felt so good and I was pumped. And she knew that it was the next morning. But being traditional Italian and guilt giving parents that they are, they asked me if I could maybe lose a little weight before the interview. <laughs> um, so my mom was just like, you know, just, you know you're going to be smart. Just try to lose a little weight before the interview. It's 20, less than 24 hours away. But I took her advice and started running uh, away from my family. And, and it's going really great so far. I wrote that. Parents, oh, what are you going to do with that? Um, <laughs> parents are crazy guys. Um, you know, when you're kids, when you're children, you know, your parents teach you how to play certain games. You know, when you're a girl, they're like, go play house. And if you're a dude, they're like, go beat up your sister. Um, <laughs> Um, and people say that's bad. They say that's detrimental. Um, I don't agree with that. I think, you know, there are certain childhood games that are helpful. Like, uh, Peekaboo really helped me with my band issues. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, where'd Daddy go? Where is he? Oh, it's just a really long game of Peekaboo. <laughs>